minor. If I were in Dorian. I'm thinking la di la so fa mi do re. La da di a dum fa da di a fum. I would do that before I started teaching any patterns. Have any of you had the experience, and by the way, I hope I don't step on any toes, and if I do, my apologies to begin with, I don't mean to. But I have watched over a period of years in music education, teachers come into a classroom. They worship the descending minor third. <laughs> and I would say to you that the descending minor third is audiating quite differently if you're audiating this is the tonic. But if you're audiating was the tonic, la, do, mi, so, mi. And if you're audiating la, la, da, has a totally different meaning. So to come into the classroom, da, 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 you might as well not teach anything. If you get the context going, la, da, 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 now that's significant meaning. So I start. And I expect children to say with that pattern. Notice my technique. I have you pause before you sing. If I do it wrong, let's do it wrong. Sing right after me. Bum, 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 bum. There's very little audiation that goes on with young singers. But if I pause, young bum, and don't let them sing right away, they have to think about what they're going to sing rather than just to imitate my last pitch. So I pause, and that stops imitation. Then I expect them to breathe. Yum, bum, bum. And this says wait, and this means breathe. Bum, bum, bum. Wait. Bum, bum, bum. Now I really have audiation going. If I can get you to stop imitating, once you learn how to imitate, and then get you to breathe, so you learn how to audit. That's the first step in hearing chord changes. Yes, sir. I noticed uh, when you were saying uh, uh, your the initial, problem. when you initially set your patterns, you were using the leading tone of the lower seven. Is that very important? Uh, it's very important in major and minor. That's why I do harmonic minor. Because we find that it's the leading tone that helps the children find the tonic. That's why I don't do Dorian. I, I give them a vast listening vocabulary in Dorian, Mixolydian. But when I get to the second vocabulary and ask them to sing, I solidify major and minor because they have that leading tone. And it's not until they've got that leading tone that I go on and then go to Dorian, which doesn't have one. The only one that has a leading tone is Phrygian, and it's an upper leading tone. I've been clear, okay? By the way, if you ask me a question and I don't give you a satisfactory answer, you just push me. <laughs> um, I'll do my best. But I really would like you to understand. Okay, so. Um, Ba, 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 ba,
first level of learning, the lowest level. Listening, producing. That's the first level, the elementary level of learning. Very sequentially, it comes first. It has to come first. Listening, performing. Second vocabulary, 